What's goody? We are off to the Sat Gamers Expo. This is our first time checking out this event and we're going on a Sunday, so let's see if it's any good. All right, so we made it down here to the Scottish Rite Center. We're about to see what this is all about. We are at the SAC Gamers Expo. Uh, yeah, woo! Apparently, uh, they have good turnout and it's a pretty good uh, event every single year. So this is my first time. I'm super excited. That's what she said. Let's uh, let's see what's good. Wow, there's a lot going on in here. It's a little bit bigger than what I thought it would be. Also, that's what she said. All right, let's take a look. All right, so we have located the Game Gears, the Nintendo DS's. We all know I'm in the lookout for the DS's, Game Boy Advance, all kinds of stuff. We're about to get our shop. Super Nintendo. There's a lot of places here. This introvert is actually trying not to get overwhelmed. There's a lot of stuff to look at here, right? Just pick that up. Look at that. Yeah. Right on. For the personal collection, yo. Create a prototype for you. Yeah, he does. I am that girl. I am that girl. I'm going to be a jerk. Remember you? But you were at Ryan's shop. I at, was at Ryan's shop. At Ryan's shop. And yes. People were tagging me. What's up? I'm Jared. Jared, I'm Queen G22. Laughing Crow Collectible. Right Jared on. Mattel, the scumbag reseller. Okay. So, uh, yeah, people were hitting me up on your video, and I was, they were like, I thought you were there. How come you're not in this girl's video? And I was like, oh, she spent her whole time, must have been talking to Bob the whole time. <laughs> I didn't even notice oh, yeah, you guys rolling well. through, so yeah. that was quick, you're picking up that controller and stuff. Right? Well, I, I was really happy that he parted with it, you know, yeah, he didn't no. want to, but um, I'm putting it to good use, so. Yeah, no, that's good, man. Yeah, so now now you were, they were posting in, like, our local collector groups on Facebook and stuff. So, Sweet. You, so now you're, you, like, instantly become, like, a little, like, a celebrity, right? Let's go! Howdy, howdy. Punch out. Oh, no. Ooh, princess. Look at Pete. Yeah, look at Girl. Exactly. What are you doing? Put some clothes on. Looking up like what characters were trash and it was the characters that I was getting good with. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, oh, I need to stop. <laughs> what is this thing? Oh, no. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Look at that. Oh, wow. I have never seen anything like that. Tommy Tronic. Manuals. This is pretty cool. What do we got here? Oh, it looks like uh, Super Contra as well. Anybody need a manual? Right on. Game Boy Advance. There's a lot of stuff here, yo. Def Jam. Hey, you remember that game? I will get my ass whooped in that game. What is the deal with Harvest Moon, dude? I've been hearing people all day asking about Harvest Moon. Did you play Harvest Moon? No, not at all. No clue. Somebody was just asking about it on Game Boy Advance. I see it on GameCube. I wonder if that's like a, I'm getting like an Animal Crossing vibe from that. I don't, I don't know. Controllers, <laughs> Atomic Purple. Hi, how are you? I'm doing great. I'm here, so. Oh, so party's here. Oh, there we go. the party is here. Right on. Thank you. Now that I'm officially in the market for uh, Nintendo DS games, Lego. I mean, I'm racing. I'm not, I like I said, I am brand new to DS. Eminem racing. Well, actually, well, is it Mad what about Madagascar? Also, I love the Madagascar series. I know Madagascar fans enjoy the, the, that particular race. They do. Yeah. Um, I, will also, I also want to mention for any of our DS titles, it's two, buy two, get one free. So if you're looking to like see what we have on any of our handheld, oh, expand the collection. Start just to try. Out. Get a good deal because it's day two. Yeah, it's Zach Amber. Yeah. yeah, we are. Okay. Look at this. Fatal Fairy. Nice. Since y'all uh, know I'm on that Neo Geo kick, this is cool to see. Oh, no. 
All right, well, the deal is just too good, so we gotta get something, especially yeah, since I just started. The deal is too good. <laughs> We're here at Polygon Sprites, and I just picked up a few DS games, Madagascar, Cars, and M&Ms. I will put Polygon Sprites info in the description. Check out my guy, Anton. He hooked us up. And uh, let's keep shopping. I don't have a Wii U yet, but I'm thinking about it. This is a good soundtrack. No opening theme All right, your girl just walked out with this uh, Super Luigi. I don't have a Wii U yet, but I will. <laughs> and this is a game that I've always wanted to play. So uh, yeah, we're, uh, we're off to a good start. This weirdo. Somebody come look at this. What is this? Patty, what is this thing? Uh, it's a PlayStation VR. PlayStation VR. Yeah. yeah, it is. Yeah, I like the meta, but I never, I never even know that PlayStation had one of those. It's pretty cool. I just started playing this game. Dude, I suck at uh, Mario 64, bro. Cosplay. We love to see the cosplay. Look what we found. What up? What up? <laughs> Look what one up has got out here. Why would we even have this for sale out here? That's just an exclusive. Oh, Tech Mobile. Super Bowl Tech Mobile. We love the Super Tech Mo. That's my game. Wrong console. Let's check out these Game Boy Advance games. All kinds of stuff. Mario Party, Super Mario World. Weren't you gonna uh, get that uh, Chrono Trigger? For you? No. <laughs> Samurai Spirits is out here. The game is hard. Samurai or Chrono Trigger? Both. We have located our first Neo Geo game spotting. How often do you see Jaguar games? Not very often. Never. Yeah, right on. So you're gonna pass on that uh, Chrono Trigger? Yeah, I don't wanna see that game ever again. <laughs> <laughs> one Up's just got a legitimate amount of stuff. We got the, we've located the MBS cartridges now. I bought the metal Oh, sh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh that's gonna be awesome. Yeah, CD's there, yeah. <laughs> Are you gonna have like a tournament and stuff? Oh, oh right yeah. on. We'll be there. That's gonna be super cool, yeah. We'll uh, definitely show up for that. You saw that the, uh, that Instagram thing that I posted, the story with the person you had the gloves on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I wanna see, yeah. Oh Y'all remember Bust the Groove, right? Bust the Groove, this used to be my jam. Was I was so actually kind of decent at this game. <laughs> yeah, let us know when you got that hooked <laughs> up. Yes, Vita, that's cool. I'm not a PlayStation, uh, you know, chick, but I know a lot of people are. And I hear that a lot of people still prefer the Vita over whatever that portal thing is that came out now. Oh, Donkey Kong Country. Oh no. Wow, look at this. Remember how I was saying I wanted to uh, collect more uh, Ninja Turtle games for the Game Boy? Yep, yep. Turtles 3, Radical Operations. $100, no case, no manual. I don't know, I'd have to do some more research on that. That just seems like a lot to drop just on a cartridge, no case. I don't <laughs> you know. have a Game Boy? No. no, I mean, yeah, I do have a Game oh, okay. Boy, yeah. <laughs> it's in a, it's, it's sealed though, I have no Oh, so you have to use mine, all right. <laughs> yeah, I would. So yeah, we'll think about that one. We do have some more DS games though. Super Mario Brothers 2. Oh, that's 3DS. Super Nintendo games. Nintendo 64, Nintendo. We love to see the more uh, Ninja Turtle cartridges. Tech Mobile, who's your squad? Raiders, Bo Jackson. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Chicago they Bears, were too, yeah. Walter Payton. <laughs> There's a lot here. Oh, these are cool. Hi. Charms. Artwork. Zelda's. Turn hey, on. Man. How you doing? Necklace, bracelets. Okay, so who is this guy? I see him a lot. I see him around a lot. Up a lot. Who is this guy? Dengar. What's his name? Dengar? Okay. What what's he from? Oh, Pokemon. That's why I don't know who he is. Alright, thank you. Looks like we kinda hit Artist Alley. Legos. Oh snap. Oh yeah. That's cool. These are cool. Pins. Kirby's. We love to see Kirby. <laughs> Pixelated stuff, right on. Oh, Genesis, Genesis. 
Like I said in the last video, nobody cares about Sega Genesis. <laughs> that upsets the people. <laughs> ah, it looks like we found the uh, complete in box place. Let's do it. Yeah, let me know. I'm ready. It's kind of slower. Oh, yeah. A little funky. <laughs> Be like Black Mike 5 is on a mission. He said he has spotted something and wants to take a look. Let's see what he found. Anime. Who are you looking for specific? Oh, no. <laughs> no, no question. Big DVD fan. Oh, there, yeah. Thank you. I feel like everyone should have a boo in their house. Although, I really only care about him. That's the only one? Yeah, he's like the equivalent of a black character, even though he's green. Oh, and he puts it back. No, I, like, I always got to do a lap, right? Why? No, no. If I stop thinking about something, right? Like, yeah, if I keep thinking about it, then yeah, I'm like, okay, then I, I want then it. Then I got to yeah. come back and get it. But if I put it down and I don't think about it again, then I know I didn't, need it. I didn't really want it. Look how adorable this used to be. I kind of thought that that thing was kind of cool. It was kind of cool, yeah. Right? It says Puckman, and does that say $200? Oh, 90, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, shit. <laughs> so the other guy, he wanted like 80 yeah, bucks. Yeah, I think yeah. It was You got a Pac-Man and you got a Puckman. If this doesn't scream nostalgia, I don't know what does. I don't know, I kind of feel like I kind of need this. What do I need this? I feel like I might need this. It's pretty cool though. This literally transports you back into time. I remember Rob, right? Look at that deluxe set in box. That's pretty dope. Got a zapper in box, a Nintendo front loader, GameCube, PlayStation, all kinds of good stuff. My Nemesis, the Nintendo that I came to get. This is black and this is purple. Whenever I see a crowd, I always want to take a look. Oh, we've located some Nintendo Switch games. Let's see if we can get over there. Mac World, Dragon Ball. Oh, Bomberman. I used to really like this game. The original, one of my all time favorite games. This game literally almost uh, put RPG on the map for me. Mega Man 11. Huh? Flash of Heroes, Harvest Moon again. Oh yeah. This is on the DS. Mario Party. Literally no clue what that is. Literally. <laughs> Aren't you getting an Animal Crossing vibe from it? Yeah. Yeah, what I found. <laughs> God damn it. God, I will play this game. Only because, like, I'm a huge Xenoblades Chronicles fan. Like, I just showed you, Definitive Edition is what put RPG on the map for me. And I keep hearing other Xeno fans say that this game is the best game in its series. I will play you one day. I want to. Um, are they? Yeah. Are they uh, open worlds? Kind of. Yeah, okay. for the most part. I'm not really good with open world game, but the storyline seems really good. Yeah. Sorry, y'all. Is our next game too. Um, set, game of six. Oh, go ahead. Oh, okay. the oh, I have never seen a figure of my guy before. This is my oh, guy. Okay, long, yeah. I literally just started watching the show. Oh, Dragon Quest? Yeah, you like it? I'm 11 episodes in and there's 100. It's pretty good, I like it. We've also got, uh, no, it's not, wasn't it, it's Ryu. <laughs> Ryu. <laughs> and uh, the beautiful uh, Chun-Li, which I have several figures of her, but I have never seen a Fei Long, so um, I guess he's coming home with me. We have spotted the Wii U, and I have been saying this whole entire time, I have games I need to play on the Wii U with no Wii U. I still have my Kongs. Yeah. Kongs. I, and you know what? I don't know why they stopped doing that because that was actually hella fun playing that playing the Donkey Kong game to the beat of those to things. Do it, yeah. You're looking for someone else who needs it. <laughs> Everybody needs, they need it. They just don't know why they need it yet until they I feel like when did they start doing these? No. No, if I've ever seen these cartridges. Yeah. This is different. It's different, yeah. <laughs> you guys seen these type of cartridges before? These are different. I just remember the um, it was like, like oh yeah, game. like I remember, I had this. I remember we had this. Oh yeah. I was like a link. That's product. what started uh, Link. No, the two, yeah. Yeah, that's what started it for us. No, yeah, there was also one with the red print, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, you're, yeah that Which one is better? Uh, I think I like the first one better than the second one. Than the second one? Yeah. 
There you go, Bible Adventures. Bible Adventures. Who's played that one? Yeah. <laughs> That's present. Oh, did you see this? Oh, snap. Graded. What is, oh, issue number 50. Oh, these are dope. These are good grades, too. I've never seen these. These are like little Mega Mans. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Those are dope. Power Ranger fans. this bad dudes thing. I don't know what that is, but I am very much intrigued because I loved me some bad dudes. Wasn't very good at it, but I enjoyed the hell out of that game. Especially playing it with my brother. Can I see this thing? Can I look at it? Or, oh, so I've located this, but um, it's not working right now. So it's hard to see, but I've never seen anything like this before. Have you guys seen this before? Let me know what to think. Also, is 50 bucks a good deal for this thing? I don't know, it's not working right now. So I think I'm, I think I'm gonna pass. Oh, I love that Mario GameCube. Awesome. Wow, look at those, those are pretty cool. With those uh, bright uh, Nintendo 64s. If they had, ooh, that clear Super Nintendo is absolutely gorgeous. Hot damn. Cool. Uh, it worked too? Does it work? Do I need that? <laughs> Do I? Those all, those? <laughs> those Super Nintendos work, work? They, they like work, work. They work, work. And they have uh, LEDs, like double LEDs. Let's say you have a vibe and you're like, oh, uh, yeah. So, yeah. So plug it. That is really cool. Is, do they change colors or that's the color you, you get? That's the solid color that comes in. And then I have one that does have one. But it has the Super Nintendo logo on it. Oh, okay. Either so, better than This is like your thing, so like there's a problem with it, you would like take care of it and all that kind of stuff? Do you have any ones with purple lights? Oh, the GameCube, but not the Super Nintendo? Yeah, you can just switch them out, or do you just make them that way? Okay, I need to think about that, but... Take a lap. <laughs> yeah, I think I... Are we doing this? I think we're doing it. Yeah, we're probably gonna do it. Arts of Nintendo Power. Arts, uh, we got a Nintendo museum, so um, let's take a look at it. I can't hear the music, Donkey Kong music. <laughs> uh, do you see do you see the battle toad over here in the corner? I, I did. I'm like, uh, boo! Oh. <laughs> There's my boo. This is cool. Is this for sale? Battle toads and double dragon cover. Very cool. And it's got both of my dad. Rash and Jimmy Lee. Dark wing duck. Ooh, and look what we have here. M. Bison. Bigger, Balrog, and Sagat. I would have been much better at the new Metroid game. Check this out. Too. We have located straight gold. Make sure you're filming. Yeah. Leonardo is one of the best fighters in the tournament, right? First sentence for Leonardo. Uh, scratch this. First sentence. Wait, I don't see where it says Donatello <laughs> is a bitch. Uh, no, it does not say that. Mm, but it does for some reason say Leonardo is one of the best <laughs> So this is pretty sick. We've got actual pages and artwork from Nintendo Power. Got the good old Mega Man. Another series that I wish I was better at, but I still ride for my guy. I really can't afford to be collecting Super Nintendo games. Neo Geo is enough. Look at all this good stuff, y'all. Y'all remember reading Nintendo Power? I do. So I'm Stefan. Uh, I'm the, the executive director of the Interactive Room. Museum. All right. Um, and this is our collection. Uh, we have a couple exhibits, but this is our Art of Nintendo Power exhibit. Inside our archive, we have over 350 pieces of original artwork from Nintendo Power magazine. Wow. Everything in the room is absolutely original. There's no reproduction. This is the actual art that was in a This is really cool. This yeah. is really awesome. So you said you have multiple exhibits. Are they out here in Sacramento, or they're just yeah, online, or what? It's in Valley, California, but we really only do travel shows. Okay. Sure. I mean, I'd show up. No. 
They're pink trees with little Kirby's all over them. For like Christmas? Or... Yeah. <laughs> this is actually though really neat that this is original artwork from Nintendo Power. Y'all know I love me some Nintendo Power. Yeah. Dude, this is like straight pencil work right here. This is amazing. Some light reading for you all. Donatello isn't as strong as other fighters in the tournament. That is a lot. But he has one special advantage on his side. He has a lot of special advantages on his side. He can outsmart them. He's figured out a way to make his heal dwap special attack move very easy to execute. This is true. Why? Because he's Donatello. If you're smart like Don, which I am not, you'll also be able to figure out the best times to use it. Right on. This must be the heel wall. Look at Thickums. Dr. Mods is what he's called because I think if I was gonna get one, here's uh, what they look like. I would want my Super Nintendo to have a purple light on the inside. I think that would be more fitting. Ooh, or a hot, a hot pink, right? A hot pink. I'm feeling the, the vibe. Very cool. Oh, snap, look. And there is a clear Nintendo. Now that's kind of really awesome. I the Nintendo or the Super Nintendo? Why not what? both? Oh my God. Yeah, why not? Why not both? I have a question. So these are modded. So does that also mean that they are modded to make easier connections to the TV, like with the HDMI, or are they still old school connections? The old school connections, they have the yellow, white, red cables. Okay. So what's that? On this one, it's something a little bit different. I changed the LED. Okay. So when you turn it on, it turns red, but then as it's playing, it changes colors. The front does? Oh, that's really neat. This one's, you know, this one will light up the red LED like it used to. The only difference is that, uh, like these ones here, I put the lights inside. Okay. Got it. I do have HDMI on this Nintendo On the Nintendo 64. So with the Nintendo and the Super Nintendo, you, it's all original connections, all that kind of stuff. Do you provide that too? Does it come with it or you gotta go get it? Oh, you can get stuff now, right? Yeah, there's HDMI there. There's HDMI. They're not small. Dr. Mods. All right, that's today. Let's get out of here. All right, so that's going to do it for us. As expected, two hours. There was a lot of stuff there. We came out with some cool stuff. I'll show you what I got in just a minute. And as far as the Sack Gamers Expo, what do you think? It's pretty good. Yeah. Good variety. Good fun stuff. Yeah, all kinds yeah. of different vendors, uh, games, toys, artwork, pins. Everything. Yeah, a little bit <laughs> of everything. So as far as me coming back next year to check it out, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll be here. All right, so let's see. So I did pick up this uh, Fei Long. I don't need any Street Fighter toys, but I've never seen a Fei Long toy, so I picked this up. I did pick up Super Luigi U. I don't have a Wii U, but I will. <laughs> and then uh, the DS games, Madagascar. Uh, cars and the uh, m and So not a super big shopping day for me. Uh, didn't spot that much Neo Geo stuff, so we are still on the lookout for, for that. But um, yeah, that was a good day. Wouldn't you, uh, you agree? Absolutely. Fun, fun. Fun, fun, fun. All right, now we'll see you guys <laughs> on my next video. Before you go, we have to do our subscriber shout outs. Now, if you're new to my channel, I like to play a game with my viewers and it's called That's What She Said. And the reason why I like to play this game is because I adore the show The Office so much that I actually use lines from the show in my everyday life, such as That's What She Said. And so sometimes I'll make a That's What She Said comment in my video. And when I don't, if a viewer finds a comment that was made that deserved that that's what she said, I want you guys to call it out. And if it's good enough, I'll give you a shout out in my next video. Now, in order to be considered for a shout out, you have to do three things. You have to one, say what I said, two, timestamp it, and three, say that's what she said. Our first shout out goes to Harold Nelson, 3312. Nice job, Harold Nelson. And this is what this person thought should have been a that's what she said. I'm doing this, okay? I am I am doing this. So you gonna hop on and ride with me? That's what she said. <laughs> nice job, Harold Nelson, 3312. A well-deserved 
call out. Now our next shout out, and I might butcher it, I apologize. It goes to Sayer Cervante. Nice job, Sayer Cervante. And this is what this person thought should have been a that's what she said. And I'm trying to be very careful. So if anyone is getting anxious, dude, chill out. All right, I'm not gonna bend my own shit. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> that one seriously had me super weak. Nice job, everyone. And now I'll see you guys on my next video.